Any song starts with a voice. The main thing that people latch onto are lyric, voice, melody. People already have a natural connection to a vocal. The vocoder supplements that, and it's just a natural harmony. Pop producers like myself are learning to use the vocoder as a real instrument now. Isotope's Vocal Synth 2 is the most comprehensive vocoder that's available today. If you're getting into incorporating more vocals into your music, you gotta dive in. Go past the presets. There's so many combinations and ways that you can use Vocal Synth 2. You can easily stumble on something that no one's done before. All right, so uh, I'll show you how I'm incorporating Vocal Synth 2 into um, just something new that I've been playing around with. I have a vocal that I got from Splice. I played some piano over it and this is uh, this is just piano and vocal. I'm done playing. Pour in the rain, yeah. It's blood in my face, yeah. I love on my face, yeah. I'm done playing. This next part, I wanted to combine a vocoder with that vocal and layer it underneath my vocal. I take the MIDI from the piano, I drag it down to a MIDI track that I'm routing to go into vocal synth, and actually, that's pretty much it. So. Now I have vocal synth playing the same MIDI basically that I was playing on the piano into vocal synth and it's going to modulate that vocal using the, this one's a multi-layer, this is polyvox, vocoder, compuvox, and biovox all together and that sounds like this. And that's like me just dragging MIDI over. So that combined with the vocal now gives you this big dramatic. I'm done playing, pouring the rain, yeah. It's blood in my face, yeah. All over my face, yeah. So the first layer is the vocoder, which is. I'm done playing, pouring the rain, yeah. Which is awesome. It's blood in my face, yeah. Probably only needs that, but why stop there? So I added CompuVox, which. I'm done playing. Even by itself. I'm done playing. Sounds awesome. But you know, and then I added Polyvox, which, you know, made it a little brighter. And then I added finally Biovox to help with articulation and stuff. Gives it a little more breathiness. And then I combined that with the original vocal. So the end result is, you know, this is not done. This is just ideas thrown around, but it goes out of this. Ramp up into this like. I mean, you can go anywhere from there. Go into a drop or just have that be the hook. Like it's, you know, yet to be determined on this one. There's so many options that it's hard to not have fun with it. I can do a million things within, you know, a minute. As long as I can work at the speed of my ideas, I'll use a plugin, and Vocal Synth 2 does that. <laughs>